is it eating? Oh, it's eating a horse apple. Mm -hmm. oh. it maybe it that, maybe fell and cracked it, and now it's eating it. Yeah, it might have fell and cracked. That's crazy. I know they love nuts, and they love my sunflower seeds. Mm -hmm. I didn't expect horse a squirrel to be eating a horse apple. That's pretty cool, though. Squirrely, squirrely, squirrely! Wonder if that's the same one that ate those sunflower seeds. Probably. It's stealing all of our stuff. Did he eat your stuff? Well, guys, it just took... It took that horse apple and went to the top of that tree. Even the girls were saying how strong that squirrel has to be to pick up that horse apple. Look, it's making droppings everywhere. That's pretty. What, babe? It climbed. It got the horse apple and it climbed all the way to the tree. I know. That's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. It must be the same one. Oh, boy. That must be a really hungry squirrel, or I don't know. It's just really oh, it's just stealing. just like horse apples. I don't know. But anyways, welcome back to Life on the Eddie Family Farm. Um, started this video out a little bit different, just because we walked outside, was getting ready to video, and the squirrel happened. So. Um, I got the girls out here. Addison wanted to be out here. Um, Rayleigh, and then we got Ziri. Ziri's our yeah. is my niece, um, their cousin. And so yeah, we're gonna go walk around and see where life takes us today. It starts out with that. Now I guess as we're walking back over here, um, the other day a squirrel, and it may even be that same squirrel. Kind of like Addison was saying, someone took my sunflower seeds, well, or one of the squirrels did. I have some video clippings of that squirrel actually stealing my seeds on the trampoline. Normally, I mean, the seeds aren't on the trampoline, but the kids, well, really the two older ones and me, we love our seeds. Um, just regular sunflower seeds. Um, Brayden likes the dill pickle ones, but... He can have all those he wants. I like to stick to original, and I, I like, like ranch, ranch also. Yeah, Addison likes I ranch. Like ranch. Yeah. That's spicy. Mm -hmm. Because ranch is um a, a flavor where you put salt in it. And yeah. Really See, I like yeah. ranch, barbecue, Taco Bell, Takis, and then a lot of them. My sister either talks about give me some seeds when she's doing her bug practice. <laughs> That's funny. But um, I'm going to go ahead and show that clipping of the squirrel stealing my seeds. And then we're going to walk down here. All right, guys. I am very far away because I don't want to scare this squirrel. But it looks like Leighton left my sunflower seeds on the trampoline last night. And the bag is open. And this squirrel is stealing my sunflower seeds. Let me go get it. No, don't get it. Braley's here with me. I'm going to try to get closer, but so I don't have to zoom in as much. Here, come here, sis. We got to walk very, very slow. Yeah, so get behind me. Okay, I'm gonna stay right here so I don't get any closer. But look. Look at that squirrel eating my sunflower seeds. He's stealing. He, he is stealing them. He needs to go to, he needs to, go to um He needs to go to squirrel jail. Yeah. He's stealing big seeds. 
That is hilarious. I'm gonna call Brandon and tell him to slowly come outside. It's hard. The sunflower seed bandit is getting away. I wonder if it would be safer or maybe better to put Princess Layla in with all the um, goats. I think the goats are back there and the donkeys and ponies. I think almost all of them are back there, but the llamas ended up getting out. Um, let me let me run inside. I'm going to talk to Brandon and see which one would be better. L letting Princess Layla just kind of roam everywhere or go ahead and make sure Badger's out. So I think I mean, the only reason she's over here by herself is because she was in here with, she was in here with Showtime. And, uh, well, now she's in here with Cowboy. But the reason we let Showtime out was because, I mean, she's getting a little bit bigger and she needed more grass and they have hay and feed every day. But um, we left her in just because we don't want Badger. Badger's way too big for her. And um, we just need to wait till she gets of age or whatever. But I think, let me go ask Brandon and then I will be right back. Okay, so I talked to Brandon and he agreed. Go ahead and put Princess Layla in the very back with, um, all the goats and donkeys and stuff. Um, one reason was because we um, we want mom, or not mom, but we want Badger to be, still be with Socks and Honey. So we're gonna leave them three on the outside and then Princess Layla can go have friends and stuff back there with the goats. So I'm gonna go see if I can find a rope and stuff and see how well this is gonna be trying to move her because she's not exactly bucket trained. She does eat out of a bucket, but she's not 100% bucket trained, so. Okay, so I got everything. We got a rope in here. Um, I don't know if it's gonna fit. I think it, I mean, I think it'll fit good enough to get her from pin to pin. Um, Addison's going to help me out with filming and hopefully I can get her up to here close enough to me where I can put this on her. Um, I'm really hopeful, but if not, I may get Brandon out here to help me. Um, and if all else fails, she can just stay in here. I was just trying to move her to give her some friends to hang out with. So goes nothing all right all right so um what we're gonna do is try to get this on her and um she can maybe run around a little bit with it and just kind of get used to it then we'll actually get the rope to try to walk her um we've never done it before so it's i know it's gonna be tricky so let's just go ahead and get it done um braley you want to stand here for me so that if she, I, sometimes I'm gonna let her go and just let her kind of walk away, especially if she starts getting mad or something. Um, and then Braylee's gonna block that off so it's not so, so big. Um, so here goes nothing. Hi, baby. I'd really like you to come over in this shade over here. But it's all right. Hi, sister. Hi, sister. It's all right. It's all right. Shh, 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 shh. It's all right. Okay, baby. It's all right. 
It's all right. I know. I know. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. I gotta watch them feet. It's all right. Shh. Here, I'm gonna pet you. Shh. It's all right. Yeah. As long as you don't spit, we'll be doing good. Mm -hmm. But seeing how... No, it's usually honey that spits. It's yeah. usually not socks. <laughs> no, no, you don't even get behind her. You'll make anybody spit. Go away, Badger. You're the reason I have to pin her up. Oh, no, don't spit. Good girl. Good girl. He's got to be all nosy over here. Mm -hmm. It's all right. It's okay. Good girl. Good girl. You're okay. Might be easier maybe. We may end up trying to get some feet over here too. Because sometimes she lets you pet her a little bit more. If she's got her head in the bucket. Yeah. But I need her head. Hi baby. It's alright. Alright. Good girl. See. I'm just going to let her go. I don't want her to think that I'm holding her down even though really I am. Come here sis. Why in that mud? Uh, it's alright baby. It's alright. Let's do it over here in the shade. Be a lot better. Let me figure this out. Alright. That'll be over the... <laughs> Just like that. All right. It's okay, baby. It's alright, so honey. Honey. Well, it's honey's just a nickname. <laughs> kind of like I call him sis, even though she's not my sis. Hi, baby. Hi, honey. It's alright. It's alright. That's all right. There you go. Come here. Come on, baby. Oh, no, don't get mean. It's all right. We may not, we may might get honey. Oh, not honey. We might get dad. Hey, now you threw mud. Look at that. She threw mud all over me. She's in that corner. Yeah. Ooh, baby. I may. Dad was just out here. Let me see if I can find him and see if he'll help me real fast. All right. So I had to call for reinforcements because I think she'll be fine, but I think she might have just got some mud on her feet, but she was acting like she was kind of kicking a little bit, but I think it's because of the mud, but it's also she was kicking. So I didn't really want to be in the middle of that. I'll let Brandon know. I'm going to help him. But um, it's going to be more of a two-person job because one's going to have to hold him down or hold her. And then I'll put the harness on, I think. So I'll give you all back to Addison. All right. I think if you hold her, because she doesn't know what that is, so it's fine to show her. But we got her up here. Maybe walk her back up there, or you got her right there. We gotta get a get her halter broke, not halter broke, but get her used to it. You got the halter there. Let's go ahead and. Yeah, we're gonna try to get her back it on it. It might be might too big. Yeah. I'm gonna make it smaller by one, cause the more I look at it, it looked a little bit big. So here we go. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Just don't spit. <laughs> Good girl. Good girl. I wish I you don't have a knife, do you? No, I don't. Not. We gotta get one. Um. Oh yeah, that's tight. Is it tight? Yeah. Okay. 
I mean, see if we can. Okay. Yeah, I think it'll be all right, huh? Yeah. All right. Got a rope. Yeah, Braley, you wanna go grab that rope for me real fast and leave that in the truck or in the side by side? Hurry. I think I need to tighten this up a little bit. There's one more I can tighten. While we're while we have her, anyways. Yeah. Good girl. There you go. There you go. Good girl. Now let's just see if she will pull away or if she's actually going to be walked. It's yeah. probably going to be. Oh, jump her away? Yeah. That's what I figured. Jump, but you got to get her used to it though. All right. Come on, baby. Ready to go walk? Come here. I know, I know. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Come on. Come on. She's like, I'm sitting by dad's side. We need to get us some llama, llama, um, halters. Come on, baby. It's all right. That's her up. Good girl. Stay with her. Stay with her. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. I know, I know. There you go. There you go. Come on. Lila. What are you doing? You'll be excited to be with all your friends. Come on. Girl. The llamas are waiting for you. Oh, come over here, I'm gonna get a drill and make a hole there. Where? Over by the garage. Come on, right, baby. You're gonna be a big girl. Come on, there you yeah. go. Good job. Good job. Maybe it's not like I'm pulling her, it's I'm walking beside her. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take a little bit to get her used to it, but she's gonna be okay. Oh, Badu, no, no. Badu. No. She being nosy. Yeah. Fresh meat. Yeah. You got it. Come on. All right. Brandon's going to grab a drill and actually put another hole in this so it's a lot tighter and um maybe it will actually fit a lot better. I mean, it's working actually really good, but like it's not coming completely off, but it'll be better. That's just, uh, I just Hi. wanna make sure you're good. You stay back, Jack. <laughs> Jack, he better stay back. All right, how are we gonna do this? You want me a holder and you take it completely off? But figure it. Like hey, come here. Come here. That's where we want it. Okay. Okay. Job. You're gonna go ahead and do the nose too. Let me look at it. Might be good. Yeah, the nose I'm good with. Okay. 
Come on, babe. Come. Beside you. Come on. <laughs> I think you just have to be beside her. Yeah. Come on. Good girl. You're doing good. Good girl. What are you doing? Come on, babe. Don't run that bat over. Come on. Come on, baby. There you go. There you go. There you go. Come on. So she may be a little bit scared of the side side because she's never out. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. She's going too far that way. Baby. Come on, you got it. Come on. Come on. No, baby. Too bad you don't have a horn. Horn, <laughs> coin. Come on, baby. We can get you in here with your friends. Uh, good girl. Look, she's doing it by herself. Good girl. She hears her friends. Good girl. I think that's what it is. She hears her friends. I'm gonna leave this halter on her right now. Yeah, there's nothing she can get hung up with that. Uh, yeah, there. so, come on, come on. Come Let's on. go in here with your friends. Come on, babe. Good girl. All right, here we go. Letting go. Looky there. She is back out with the ghost now. She is, now she's got many a friends. Now we'll watch them just because Princess Layla hasn't actually been for a while anyway. She hasn't been with one of the goats and the goats aren't going to do nothing. They may um, head butter just like they do themselves and like they do the dogs and whatever, but um, she'll get used to that. Plus she's bigger than them, so maybe not. But and she got the donkeys. I'm going to watch the donkeys and the ponies though with her. Um, just because, one, she still, she still is young, even though she's been eating grain for a while, so I don't know how that works with, like, you know, Red is a mama, so she's got milk, so I know babies can smell that milk, so I don't know if she will try to nurse from her, and then the donkey will get mad. We're gonna, I'm gonna sit here and watch for a good while, um, just kind of off and on throughout the day. So, look, she's over here like, Brennan, what did you do to me? No, baby. Let's go turn the fence back on, please. Hurry. There you go. Good girl. What are you doing in there? I wanted you to come around this way where all the goats are. Be excited to see your new friends again. I know one thing, the electric fence is not meant for her because even when she was up there, she never really went, like touched the fence, even though it wasn't really hot wire, she never touched it anyways because she didn't want to get close to us really. But she was getting so much better. Princess Layla. Do you think Dixie and them will be nice to her? Yeah, the dogs will definitely be nice to her. So what are you guys up to, huh? You been touching any fences lately? Huh? Here, gotta go. <laughs> Might bend down and see if you got some treats or something. Pretty sure it's still hot, hot. Yeah, I can hear it even right here. That's the deal. Was they was getting used to it not being on. Yeah. Yeah, they touched it a few times because. Uh, oh, yep. Somebody just got hit over there. A baby. Huh, yep. Gracie's about to touch it right there. Oh, because they're in the dog dish. Yeah. I'm sorry. They shouldn't have. Hey, y'all got plenty of clean water right over there. 
What are you doing drinking out of there? We gotta get those cleaned out so we can put some dog food in later on this evening. I fed them over there on the other side a little bit ago. Okay. I fed them in the other troughs. All right. Good, good. But you can see the ponies are back here. Bush, uh, not Bushwhacker. Um, Showtime. No, the other one. Buddy is back here too. Then the other donkeys right here. I'm fixing to go get you some spray. I'm gonna go get some spray right now. Where are you going? I'm gonna go get you some spray. All right. So Brandon's gonna go grab some spray and he'll be right back. Hey. Bushwhacker wants a drink. A drink? There you go. A drink? You like that orange Gatorade? A drink? Let's see. You want some? <laughs> She's like, oh, that smells good. Oh, I got your nose. You gotta lick it off now. <laughs> Hold down. <laughs> You want some? You want some more? You want some more? It smells good, doesn't it? I know. I, I love the smell. I know. My orange. I think orange has become my favorite. It used to be blue and white, but yeah. But now we got orange. Mm -hmm. Orange almost gives you that refreshing, like yeah. orange juice. Uh huh. You want some more? Like you don't like hers here. Maybe maybe he wants some of mine. Where is mine? <laughs> Well, since Let's he touched see. it, mine, I don't want to drink it now. Addison didn't know mine was a favorite, so she got her orange and then me white. But that's all right. I still like it. At least it's a drink. It's a cold charcoal. Here you go. Hey, baby. Confession. I guess I'm going to have to finish drinking. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not like Brandon. Brandon yeah, may drink either. after the cow, but... I'm not doing it. Nope. So, all right, I think I see him coming. All right, Brandon finally made it back over here. Where y'all been? In the shade. Y'all been, been drinking coffee? We've been sitting on our back porch in the shade. I haven't been drinking coffee. Coffee. Drinking we only coffee. do that in the morning. I'll tell you, I'll probably get up and run, but maybe not. There he goes. Me and Addison were getting nervous because he was touching the fence, but I forgot that fence is not hot. Bushwhacker, that's going to help you, buddy. Bushwhacker. Let's see if I can get on the front side of him. I'll get by here. Hey, come here. A few more sprays, Bushwhacker. That's going to help you a lot. I know you loved it the last few weeks. <laughs> Guineas might get deflied. So I don't think any of our animals actually like getting sprayed. Nope. But I tried to go around him. Addison tried going around him, but he ran off. So we at least got him enough to Give him stop itching oil. for a minute. Yeah. It It'll work when he comes up this evening. We got a full bottle. Usually we keep this with us in the side by side. Um, and then we will just have it when we see him, we'll spray him. But um, I bought some th stuff for the side by side. We're going to be mounting on there here pretty soon. That way we can have all of our gear and everything. Yep, ready to go. That way can, we can do some farming. Awesome. So, well, we didn't expect Bushwhacker to run away, but I am glad you waited till. You gotta see Bushwhacker get fly sprayed on. So, anyways, I'm gonna see if I can catch them some more. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up, turn notification bell on, and, and subscribe. subscribe. God bless. God bless.